Well, today Tim and I were out here on Spring Lake. Uh, it's by the community of Stony Plain, just west of Edmonton. It's a beautiful little lake. Uh, probably its biggest problem is that it's hard to get on unless you're an Edmonton Trout Club member or own property on the lake. But once you're out here, it's beautiful. I think we're the only people out on the water. And maybe they know something we don't, the other fishermen, because it's been a pretty slow day. You know, it's, uh, it's not that hot. It's maybe 21, 22 degrees. The water's a decent temperature. It's, you know, maybe 15 or 16 degrees Celsius. It's only 66 to 67 degrees Fahrenheit. But it's been tough. We have a chop. Fish aren't really up in the water. We've caught, I think we've landed four or five fish, but we've been doing four or five different things to get each one. We haven't really been able to establish a pattern, so we've tried a few spots, tried a few different lines. I think right now I've got a type five, Tim's got a type six. We've used intermediates, caught fish like that. The one thing we haven't had a hit was with any kind of indicator fishing, so we kind of put that away. The loon's angry at us. And uh, we're gonna check out another couple spots and see what we can do. So uh, we've had a pretty slow day out here and I was just kind of joking around with Nick and I hooked a fish joking around. So I guess uh, sometimes kidding around works for you. I got it on a back swimmer. And uh, it looks uh, pretty chunky actually. He's all wrapped up in the tequila booby. Yeah. <laughs> and actually that thing's been working all right as well, so. Oh yeah. He's pretty fat for the size. Like I don't think it's super long, but they're definitely weighing a couple pounds here. Oh, let's see if I can net him. He's pretty hot right now. Got nice pink colors. There we go. Whew. Gave me, a, gave me a bit of a bath there. <laughs> oh, he's got some sores on him. Okay. Oh, just in the tip of the, just in the tip of the snout there. I'll clear this out of the way so I don't get hooked. <laughs> oh. And there we go. Fly pops out. Pretty fat. Pretty fat, not too long. Oh yeah, look at that. He's got some sores all over his face. Right there. And on his back, but other than that, pretty chunky fish, eh Nick? Awesome. <laughs> Had my uh, fly dangling over the edge of the boat, and took the back swimmer again. We might be onto something here. And there's a, it's uh, not even the end of August yet, but we've had some pretty good back swimmer fishing in years past on back swimmers at the end of August. It's I'll bring this guy in. Oh, and he popped off. Right at the boat. <laughs> in spring, Nick and I packed up the boat and the trailer and we headed off to the province of Manitoba. We were greeted with some inconsistent weather, but we did manage to catch some large trout. Check it out.
Woo! Uh, at westernsportfishing.ca. <laughs> <laughs>